Okay, so in this video I'll be showing you how to connect your Arduino to Blink over USB. So to start off, go to File, Examples, uh, Blink, Board and Shields, and Arduino Serial USB. This will be the example that we will be using. Uh, and in here there are instructions on what to do, but for this video I will just be uh, going over um, the important stuff in case you are confused by anything. So let's start off with um, step one. It's optional, so we'll just ignore that. Uh, in step two, edit auth token and upload the sketch. So you want to edit it, uh, put edit this and put the um, auth token on your app into here. So let's switch over to the Blink app right now. Okay, so we are in the uh, app right now. So let's get the auth token by pressing this nut icon here. And the token should be this right here and you can email it to yourself to make it a little easier. Okay, so now we have the auth token uh, copied, so let's paste it in here. And now let's upload this sketch to the Arduino. Okay, now that it is uploaded, let's go to step three, which is running the script that will connect your Arduino to the Blink server. So to do that, open command prompt by typing CMD. Uh, type in cd uh, space and copy and paste in the location of where the blink scr.bat folder is. Uh, that is in the scripts folder in the blink library. So copy this and paste in here. If you can't find it or don't know where it is, you can just type in scripts in here and it should be the one in file folder in blink. You can, it's the same here as well. So press enter. Now to run it, let's type in, uh, let's actually copy this in here and paste it. This will run the uh, script that will connect to the Blink server. Um, but we'll need to modify this a little. So instead of COM4 here, we'll want to put in the port that we're using, which is COM3. Uh, and before making a connection, I recommend pressing the reset button on the Arduino. I find that this clears any connection problems that might happen. After that, let's press enter, press again, and now we are connected to the Blink server. So let's move on to an example of this. Okay, so now let's make a button in the app that will turn on the onboard LED here. So to do that, press this plus button, uh, make a button. And in here, set the pin to digital D3, here. And then when you're done with that, press this play button. And then whenever I press this, the LED should blink. Let me uh, unfocus it so you can see a little better. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section.